Hey guys, it's Viewmaster's Reaction, and we're back with what might be the final video, for today at least, of The Legend of Vox Machina. This one is going to be the people who we just met, the cast of Critical Role, the people who do all the voices of the upcoming show, The Legend of Vox Machina. We found out who they are, we found out who they do the voices of, we have them here again, and now we're just going to jump into them doing a scene from the show so we can see them in action. Now we know who they are, I want to see them in action. I love doing things like this. When you see famous people, not that they're super famous, I mean some of you might know them, I only recognize the girl closest to me in the top row, and I don't even remember from what, but I definitely recognize that girl's face. She's the voice of the short armored mage girl that has the the mace, her name is Pike. She's the only one I really recognize, but I love watching anybody, specifically famous people, when they're belting out voiceovers for cartoons and animated shows and stuff like that, it's great because you're kind of out of your element and people are watching you and sometimes you just gotta like do weird things to get the voice right and stuff. So I'm curious to see, I don't even know what scene we're gonna see. I'm assuming they picked a scene where it won't really spoil much, but we're about to find out. If you guys want to see more Vox Machina content, we have at least four videos on the channel, and I will be reacting to the show in full three episodes a week. I don't know how quick I'll get it up on YouTube, but I will definitely get them up on Patreon as quick as possible in full, so check that out. If you guys want to see more of what I do, full-on edited versions of all the shows on the channel, seasons ahead of what you're seeing, and hundreds of exclusives only on Patreon, the link is in front. If not, this is the live animation read-along for the Legend Legend of Vox Machina. This I'm excited jump, about. Jump, 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 oh, they just got jump, right into jump, it. Jump, jump, oh, and we're at a jump, bar. Jump, 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 jump. Yeah! <laughs> That's right. Who's the best? I love it. Rog wins. Again. They're just oh, off the cuff, fuck man. Me. Why do we always play drinking games with a guy twice our size? He does kind of look familiar. The fastest way to get drunk, obviously. This is who's drunk. <laughs> this Not is great. me. I'm great. I think we should go to another. Get yeah. another. See, oh, I love that they're oh, like. Didn't you only have one ale? Oh, oh, I'm so chunky. Oh, watch it, bitch. Hey, you watch it, dick and he even did Easy, Grog. We don't waste our time on talking assholes, remember? There's a jacked wolfman oh, person Keith. thing. Another round for Vox Machina, the greatest band of mercenaries in all the realm. <laughs> the greatest? I heard you couldn't even rescue a cow from a burning barn. <laughs> Vox Machina, what a fucking joke. <laughs> <laughs> Let's keep things civil, friend. We're not I love his trouble. voice. He's got a great... Oh, I mean, they all wait. do. <laughs> Everyone knows you're a bunch of pathetic losers who can't get a fucking job. Look at your scrawny ass. Too weak to tickle your own pickle. You offering to help? Yeah. Uh, no, I... Uh, fuck you! I'm only asking you to give me a hand. <laughs> oh, oh, shit! You know, Max, I'll take his willing. Oh, can I keep this? Uh, don't just stand there cooking lumps! I love there's like a wolf guy that's standing upright like a wolf man. Uh, and they're all, I love it, they all are so in. Well that ended quite abruptly. I was like, what the hell's going on? And then all of a sudden the girl from the boys gets hit by a bus and I'm like, oh, it's a commercial. I was like, holy crap, what just happened? The animation collided with the real people and turned into a superwoman. But. Great stuff, guys. That kind of stuff I could watch for hours. I mean, they were spot on. The fact that they just went off the cuff, I'm assuming they told him we're going to do this scene. But the fact that they were all so on point, and this guy is obviously doing more voices because his character wasn't there, so he did the voice of the brute in the bar who's hand they chopped off. I'm assuming this happens way earlier in the show because they probably wouldn't show clips from things that are important or monumental in the story. So I have to assume this happens earlier. It sort of looks like after a battle or once they all come together because most of them are together and they're drinking and I don't know. I assume there's going to be a lot of drinking. There's obviously violence and cursing. It's R-rated. I'm loving all of it. And Everybody seems so into it. This is what I was saying in the beginning, how it's interesting to see the people when they do the voices, because sometimes you got to be very animated looking in order to get the voices out, because you're not acting it out yourself. Like in an actual live action movie, if you're playing the role of the giant guy in the bar who's about to beat the crap out of somebody, you don't have to express yourself because you're physically 
about to beat the crap out of somebody. But in this, you have to like build up the adrenaline and the sound of your voice and like pile it on like enthusiastically while standing or sitting in a chair. So they're all about it. They're like like hopping out of their chairs. I'm like, I don't know, I don't know. Like I love the girl on the end was like the redhead. Great. I mean, they're all great. I don't, I'm not discounting anybody. But the two that stood out in my mind were the girl, the redhead all the way to the end. She's great because she her character was puking her guts out and she's even like showing like she was going to puke, bloating her cheeks and everything. The dude behind her, Liam, who does the one of the twins, I can't remember, Voxelia, Vox, Voxald, I don't know, but he is like the thief guy with the knives. He stands out just because he's got a great voice for that character, like almost like a James Bondy soothing kind of like like you just trust him kind of thing. This guy closest to me, the most passionate, charismatic guy of the group who I feel like is the leader of Critical Role. I'm sorry if he's not, but he just has so much passion behind everything he says that he's, it's like every character's voice he does, you're just like behind. But everyone's great. No one's bad. Things look great. I only want to see it more every time I see another video. This was the last one, I believe, of the ones you guys told me to watch. So I'm gonna go edit all these up. I'm gonna throw them up on the channel. You guys let me know what you think. You wanna see more of what I do, full on edited reactions, all the shows on the channel, season ahead of what you're seeing, Patreon link in front of me, hundreds of exclusives you'll never see anywhere else. Go check the link. If not, comments down below, like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.